But when I tell you guys, I, I, I can't stop. I, hi everyone, thank you for joining me today. My name is Tanaj Nikki, and today I'm going over a Timu haul. I'm super excited to show you guys this fantastic site. You'll be addicted, so you've been warned. I bought several kinds of items. I bought clothing, I bought jewelry, I bought hair accessories, and I bought a couple of beauty items. So if you're interested in content like this, make sure you give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. And if you're subscribed, make sure you click the notification bell so you have everything I have coming out here on YouTube. So let's get into it. Okay guys, so first things first, it is Temu, T-E-M-U, and I found out about this really cool site from a fellow YouTuber and a friend of mine, Alicia Buzzer Beauty. I'm gonna have her stuff over here and also in the description box below so you can check out her Temu hauls because she has a couple under her belt as well. And I think she found it from another fellow YouTuber. So there's this Temu train that's happening. But I have not kept my mouth shut about this place ever since I looked into it. Now because like I said, I saw some of the items that Alicia had in her haul, I did have an idea of what I would be getting and the type of quality I would get. But you know, I still kind of had to see for myself, you know? I wanna tell you guys, I. I can't stop. I, like it gives wish vibes with the crazy prices of how cheap everything is, but it's it's decent quality. Like you are getting very much bang for your buck. And it gets here super quick. I got my order in approximately a week, like seven business days. So anyways, let, let's get into what I got this time around. I'm gonna start with the things that I am absolutely the most impressed with, which is the clothing. So, okay. When I tell you I was super sketch on the clothing, I was super sketch and I am pleasantly surprised. I'm gonna start with like the coolest piece that I saw. The name of this item is Solid Faux Leather Jacket, Fashion Chain Zipper, Bodycon Crop, Long Sleeve Outerwear. And I know that sounds like a lot and you should just give it like a cute name, but obviously they're going off with descriptions that people might type in. And oh, you guys check it out. Check it out. This was like, what? And the sticker price for this was only $12.59. And the fact that you see how it fits, how it like this fits fits uh you guys will see my measurement coming up here and i got this in a size medium i kind of went off the things that i will buy as if i was shopping at fashion nova so typically i am a medium top medium sized dress and large bottoms so that was kind of the idea that i went with here and it, it fits perfectly obviously you can see it fits perfectly. When I put the hood on, I got very like Whitney Houston and Bodyguard vibes. Like this is such a cool piece. I couldn't have asked for a better introduction to this site and what I can expect to get from them. And yeah, I'm again, super excited to have this piece and I think that it's gonna be a great addition to my wardrobe. Now the second thing that I am absolutely the most impressed with are the blue rip straight jeans, flash pockets distressed, high rise wide leg, high waist denim pants. I typed in high rise wide leg pants because that's kind of the vibe I'm going for. If you guys are going to make me leave skinny jeans, they still have to be high waisted, at least for now, okay? like I. <laughs> and I did get this in a size large. I mean, depending on the cut and everything like that, it, knowing that this was like true denim, I wanted to lean towards the bigger baggier side because nothing's gonna stretch for me. So I did get a large, which reads eight slash 10 in most regular US women's sizes. You guys see, they fit perfectly, perfectly. I haven't felt this good about regular jeans in God knows how long. I had these one pair of jeans that I had that I remember I think the year was maybe like 2002. They fitted at the waist, but they were the widest leg jeans. One of these legs could be a denim skirt, wide leg jeans. And I love these jeans, love them. 20 years later, I'm still thinking about those jeans. These remind me of those jeans. That's how ecstatic I am about these jeans. I'm going to buy a lot more in the specific silhouette. I need it in dark wash. I need some that aren't ripped. Come on, come on, I'm with the program, I'm with it. And the sticker price for these jeans was $15.29. This, these two pieces alone, has me in this website like this. We're gonna keep going because there's a lot more to go through. I set the bar that high so you know why. I'm, I'm giving you all this energy about this website. The next item I want to talk to you guys about is the halter bodysuit. This is a solid blacklist sleeveless waist bodycon suit. So I just wanted to put in a bodysuit and see what came up. Uh, this item was selling for $6.48 and 
I think this is very much worth the quality. It's nothing to write home about as far as like it being the most superior bodysuit that I've ever worn. I did get this in a medium and I think the medium works fine but I actually could have gone small. But it is a very very comfortable bodysuit. This neutral color, it actually says light purple, that is not light purple. To me that's a nude so I didn't have any nude bodysuits so I thought that, that would be a good start and I couldn't ask for anything more. It, it just does what it's supposed to do. It came out to about five dollars. Sign me up. I need more. <laughs> Another clothing item that I got. This solid black pants, high waist, casual, everyday for spring fall women's clothing. That's the title of it. I would say these are very lightweight, high-waisted, wide-leg cargo pants. They're solid black with a tiny bit of sheen on them but again they're very lightweight. I would not call this a winter pant at all. These were $16.48. Pleasantly surprised with this quality. Even though it's thin, it doesn't feel necessarily cheap. I also did get these in a size large. There is no stretch to it, so a large was the right call for me. I'm super excited to have pants that look like this. And it still has that slight sheen to it to elevate it just a little bit. Ah, chef's kiss. Super happy about these pants. Last clothing item we're gonna talk about is the shirt that I'm wearing right now. They're calling it the Elegant Solid V-neck sweater. Casual cross long sleeve sweater, casual tops for fall and winter. It is very much a sweater that is ribbed, so it stretches quite a bit. I did get this in a size medium. Again, this one could have gone small as well. I styled it here with a cable knit sweater skirt, uh, just to kind of see what it would look like if I were to style this for like a work piece or something a little semi-formal. Obviously, you can dress this up or down, treat it like any other white casual top but again it has really good weight to this this is an item I would consider a winter or fall item this probably wouldn't be that comfortable in the springtime the pricing for it was $11.98 and it comes in several colors so you know if you have enough white tops or you just don't want a white sweater it also came in light gray and black I'm kind of addicted to buying black and white tops I need to fix that <laughs> this closing piece was another home run I'm really excited for this to be another outlet to find some other fantastic unique cool pieces for a great price. So the other major thing that I bought was jewelry. I'll lump this in with hair accessories because it's kind of the same. None of these items outwardly express being nickel free. For me personally, this is something that I can't wear regularly or consistently. Uh, I have to give my skin a break when it comes to coming in contact with nickel. So if I am wearing it, it will be only for the time that the outfit is on and then it has to come off. Like I definitely can't sleep in anything like that. But for cute styling accent, this is a fantastic way to have options. The most expensive bundle I saw was just about two dollars everything else was like a dollar 88 or so some came with four or five ring packs i leaned in and got silver and gold uh, just to have options here half rings full rings ones that mimic cubic zirconia other ones that look like more in silver i will say if you're looking for something that looks like as real as you can get it for paying pennies for i would say stick to silver the gold does tend to come off as pretty cheap and fake like something that you could find in like those uh little vending machines that kids pay like 50 cents for. A couple of those rings are like that and I likely won't be wearing those rings and styling. And honestly that's the kind of thing that I was looking for. How decent of a quality can I get for you know under a dollar or you know a bundled set that is under two dollars. Individual ring pieces like this triple band with the butterfly extension. That piece alone was like a dollar fifty and that one is one of the best looking ones in my opinion. While there was a bundled set of about six rings for the same price that was gold and those look a little bit like stuck on plastic pieces on top of each other. The realer you want it to look, go ahead and pay, you know, more. In this instance, you kind of do get what you pay for. I did buy a couple of ear cuffs and that is something that I'm, I'm quite addicted to. When my hair is up, Having cuffed earrings, I think it's just one of the coolest things. I have a lot of cuffed earrings. <laughs> a fun fact about me, I actually have a cochlear implant and I wear jewelry usually to accent the cochlear implant versus kind of like hiding it. If you have a disability, you might as well be cute about it, right? <laughs> so things like cuff earrings or multiple studs and stuff, I don't mind bringing attention to it. And of course, a cuff earring will definitely bring attention to my ear. I was just really excited to find really cool pieces like that. Again, they were under like two dollars it's one of those things where i'm finding such a variety of things to try i'm going to definitely be keep diving into those kind of pieces when i go back searching for things on the site like i mentioned previously i do love wearing really cool hair clips this one with like the dangly pearls it just screams fashion i can be very extra in a lot of ways when it comes to fashion well i love extra little details i like accent pieces i love statement pieces and although of course you need your basics 
having just one accent piece can make the whole outfit. And that could be like this mermaid looking hair clip. Why not? And especially when it is like $2. I would highly suggest if you are into things like hair barrettes, hair clips, things like that, Again, this site it is for you. I am definitely going back to find more cool things to stick around my head. <laughs> The last two things in my haul that I'm going to discuss were a couple of beauty items. I found these triangular puffs. It was a whole pack of five for a dollar and fifty-two cents. So I figured even if like it was really crappy, I just paid a dollar fifty for five puffs. So why not? And sure enough, you can see here it, it literally it it does its job. It does what it's supposed to do. I used it today when I was getting ready to film this. So um, I'm very excited because the little triangular puffs are something that, as a makeup artist, I have molded my puffs to do so to have a puff that already just kind of sits there and you don't have to do anything but tap perfect i'm really excited to have a multiple of those and i also picked up these beauty sponges i've not tried them yet because i was already knee deep into the one that i've been using for a second now i am excited about these because they're quite squishy they do remind me of like a beauty blender but just a little firmer which is actually the texture that i like elf has a similar textured sponge but i think that one might be like three dollars singularly like for one i pay for a full pack of eight for a dollar 88 this is absolutely worth your risk i think you're getting incredible quality for the items that you're picking up and i look forward now to other beauty items that they have i already have a cart full of other things that i want to get from this site <laughs> I'm trying to be patient with myself. A fair warning, again, if you want to look into this site, I highly suggest you do, but you're gonna get addicted to it. All right, guys, that was my Temu haul, and I'm beside myself. I really hope you guys enjoyed that as much as I did, and I hope you're ready for more, because there, there will be more. There will be more from this site. <laughs> so if you enjoyed today's content, make sure you give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. And if you're subscribed, make sure you click the notification bell so you not five everything I have coming out here on YouTube. Thank you again, Alicia, for putting me on to this site. And if you guys uh, want to use her code and everything, I will link it to the video where she has all that information so you can use her code to shop for your first order off. Thank you all again so much for everything, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.